Scott Allen Sumner. I am 14 years old. I'm Matthew O'Neill. I'm 12. My name is Jennifer Sumner and I am Scott Sumner's mother. Hey, I'm Matthew O'Neill's mother and my name is Stacy O'Neill. We actually met in a parent support group. We had been in the intensive care unit. I had gone down to do the activity for the day and she was across from me and we had talked a little bit there and then whenever um, my son Scott moved up to CCU, uh, we were sitting down in the window and she came out of her room and she just, it was just automatic. And then from there on, the boys and us, we just kind of, we just clicked. We did. We like to go down to the harbor a lot and win stuff animals and play some games down there. And Mario Kart. Mario Kart. But he wins every time. Every time Scott leaves and if Matthew can't go with him down to the harbor, he's like, I've got to get Matthew something while we're here. Scott and I really enjoy pickling together. Scott never made pickles, but he always loves anything sour. So. When he heard that Matthew had made pickles, he goes, I want to try that. So then they made um, pickles and corn and green beans together in the family room. Matthew was looking forward to, you know, them becoming friends, being able to do things together, go to the harbor together, play games together. What do you think about that? Well, when one of them is having a bad day and they're in their room and in their bed, the other one will come and knock on the door and say, hey, how are you doing? And sit at the door. It just means you have somebody that is going through the same thing as you are, and you're not alone in what you're doing. It means a whole lot. It means just that I have a friend that like really, really cares like a lot for me. He likes to hang out with me almost every time, and I love that. The couple years I've been here, I've had no one to hang out with when I was in the hospital, and with Matthew here, it is a whole lot better. Well, I feel like I've been very fortunate enough to have a front row seat to this friendship that's developed. Um, I've worked with both boys separately, and I think a real game changer for each of them on these extended admissions was having a buddy, someone that has walked a similar path to them, someone that understands their hard days and their bad days, as well as their good days. And it's been really awesome to watch this bond develop between the two of them. They really care about each other and they value each other. I do. And it's, it's <coughs> the sweetest thing, it really is. The bond that they have is just something that they'll have you know, a lifelong. I mean, they're, they're heart brothers.